Christmas in my heart. Years ago, a funny poem was passed down to me by my first broker and mentor, Carolyn Harris. Many of you in the Shawnee area will remember her as a stalwart in the real estate community. A wonderful, smart businesswoman and somebody I looked up to so much. Somebody she looked up to was Mary Crooks, who she believes gave her this poem many years before that, probably in the 80s sometime. Mary Crooks was uh, a closing agent at Southwest Title, which is now First American Title in Shawnee. So lots of history there. And she probably got it from somebody else who uh, thought it was funny and wanted to pass it on. It's a poem that I have used when I've emceed different uh, groups, usually a, a realtor association, around the Christmas time. And uh, it's something that audiences have enjoyed. I have it on my blog here. But I wanted to read it to you just because it's kind of fun to listen to as well. So enjoy. Twas an hour before closing and the office was tense. The first closing in months was about to commence. With interest rates high and discounts out of sight, who would have believed there would be a closing tonight? Overhead was up and business was dead, but visions of commission checks now danced in their heads. The loan was approved by FHA's good grace. Everyone knew it was a borderline case. The purchasers divorced, remarried again, divorced once more and now were just friends. The loan package complete to the attorney was carried with instructions to close before they remarried. The title policy was ordered and when it came in, an improper legal, three judgments and a lien. Other than that, it looked pretty clean. The title was cleared and the closing was set. All requirements of the lender had finally been met. The attorney was called final figures to get Lo and behold, the buyers were short by 74 cents. The lawyer gave a quarter, the closer a dime, and the sellers held a mortgage for the other 39. With all this settled and closing at hand, everyone wondered what else would they demand? In the twink of an eye, the closing was soon to take place, all the little agents happily sitting in place. When all of a sudden, the phone rang with a clatter. The broker sprang from his chair to see what was the matter. He answered the phone, and you could tell by his groan. Twas the mortgage company on the other end of the phone. Everyone listened as he sputtered and coughed. They knew in a flash that the closing was off. The attorney and broker were scurrying around, and the buyers and sellers both broke down. The agent sat still, silent and dazed. His hands began to tremble and his eyes were quite glazed. Then more rapid than eagles, his curses they came. He screamed and shouted and called them by name. Now buyers, now sellers, both women and men. Now broker, now lawyer, now lender and friends. The closing is off, what more can I say? Then Merry Christmas to all and to all a good day. Merry Christmas.